and all these numbers we have to shown on the line so firstly we will draw a straight line and mark the numbers with equal distances here we have marked with the equal distances and then assign a number 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 and on the left hand side on the zero minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 and minus 4 you can see here we have numbers from minus 4 to positive 3 and all these numbers between these two integers we will write here we will represent on the line part number 2 minus 1 to positive 6 same Firstly, we will draw the straight line. Here you can see this is a straight line, and then mark with equal distances. Here we will mark the points, and then after this we will assign a number. Here you can see one, two, three, four, five, six, and on the left hand side on the zero we have minus one. So these are the numbers from minus one to six. we will represent using the line numbers part number 3 from positive 5 to 5 we have to represent same we will draw the straight line and then mark the point with equal distances you can use the scale and mark with the help of scale here you can see i mark all the points and then assign a integers 0 1 2 3 4 5 and on the left hand side minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 minus 4 and minus 5 let's question number 2 start I write the numerical value of the given integers so here we have to find out the numeric value of minus 6 so firstly we will draw a bar on the 6 here you can see when i remove this bar we have minus sign here you can see i remove this bar and we have minus sign only those integer that has already minus sign so you can see this is it's already minus sign and this sign is a sign when i remove this bar so you know that minus and minus becomes a positive so numerical value of minus 6 is 6 part number 2 we have to find out the numeric value of the minus 28 so we will draw the bar here you can see this is a bar and whenever i remove these bars we have a minus sign and this minus sign is already a variable minus 28 you can see and i remove these bars here we have a minus sign now minus minus if we multiply by 2 minus we have a positive now the numeric value of minus 28 is 28 part number 3 we have already positive sign so the positive value of 43 the integer numeric value is also 43 so the numeric value of 43 is the 43 now part number 3 question number 3 arrange the given integers in ascending descending orders so so this is a question number 3 sorry i write it by mistake so minus 10 minus 1 positive 1 Minus six and zero, and we will write it into the ascending order. Descending order means from higher point to lower points. Here you can see positive one is the higher, then below is zero, then minus one, minus six, and minus ten. Part number two. Positive three, minus three, minus four, positive four. Minus two, positive two. Here we will write it into descending order. Here in the descending, I am again repeating the ascending 
This ascending means we have to ride from higher point to lower points. So positive 4, then positive 3, positive 2, minus 2, minus 3, and minus 4. Question number 4. Prove that. Here we have a equations. We have to prove that the left hand side is equal to right hand side. We will solve these equations. Now, here we have a left hand side. You can see here plus minus minus and plus plus plus. Now we have 11 and 6. You can see here plus minus minus 11 minus 6 we have 5 but in the plus and minus we will see which integer is greater and we will write the greater integer sign you can see the greater integer is 11 that is why we write here positive same for there plus minus minus 11 minus 5 we have 5 now you can see here left hand side is equal to right hand side now this is second part Firstly, we will solve the bracket. In the multiplications, if we multiply two integers, the signs are also multiplied. So here, 2 and that 2, I write here 2 and plus minus minus. This minus 3, I will write as it is. Same for there, plus 1, I will write as it is. And 3 to the 6 and minus minus, you know that is equal to positive. That is why I write here positive. Again, 3 to the 6. And signs are also multiplied minus minus plus. 6 one the 6 and plus plus you know that is equal to plus. So students left hand side is equal to right hand side. Part number 3. Here you can see we will simply multiply 8 7 the 56. Now minus minus plus. Same for 8 7 the 56 minus minus plus. Left hand side is equal to right hand side. Part number 4, firstly we will solve the bracket, you can see here, now plus minus, minus, I will write here minus and solve the bracket. This positive 27 I will write as it is, now minus 24 I will write as it is. Firstly I will solve this bracket, now plus plus I write here plus. So here you can see minus minus is equal to plus, now 24 plus 13 is equal to 37 and which integer is greater you know that 24 is greater and it has negative sign that is why I write here negative minus 24 now you can see plus minus minus 27 minus 13 is equal to 14 and 27 is greater it has positive sign that is why I write here positive now plus 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 27 as it is now plus 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 after this you know that plus minus minus 37 minus 27 we have 10 same for 24 minus 14 we have 10 here you can see 37 is greater it has negative integer that is why i write here negative now here 24 is greater it has negative sign that is why i write here negative so left hand side is equal to right hand side question number five fill in the boxes here we have to fill in the box right answer you can see here the plus mi minus minus plus so 23 plus 18 is equal to 61 part number two same for we have to write the uh, right integer in the box so student right integer is minus 20 the reason is that plus minus 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 11 and minus 20 is equal to minus 31 now part number 3 so right answer we will write in the box that is 28 here we write the minus sign now plus minus 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 plus 24 now part number 4 student we will write the right integer in the box that is positive here you can see plus minus minus now here we have minus 87 and here we have positive 123 after the minus we have 36 so we have question number 6 let's start first part you can see first we will take the common you can see here plus minus minus now 
minus 182 divided by 14 we will write into integers form now 182 divided by 14 the answer is equal to minus 13 part number 2 here first we will take the common so here you can see positive positive you know that is equal to positive and 345 divided by 23 first we will write into division form and after the division operation we have positive 15 part number 3 1221 divided by minus 111 we will take the sign common you can see here plus minus minus and we will write into division form 1221 divided by 111 after division we have an integer minus 11 part number 4 minus 4140 and divide by 345 first we will take the common sign you can see plus minus minus that is why I write here minus now we will write into division form write that now after the divisions we have the answer is minus 12 so students this is our access review exercise that is completed today I hope you understand well if you have any questions you can ask me I will give you an answer as soon as possible so take care Allah Hafiz